Okay. What's up, guys? My sister just came in, which is why I'm starting it. Okay, this is the six hour. Six hour. P228 says right there. Right there. Probably can't see it. But it says it. Um. It's a nice gun for 14 bucks, tell you that. I'd say it should be worth about where I live. I could probably sell this on the street, broken up with a broken trigger, and without the grip, I'd probably sell it for like 20 bucks. Because you're in my area, would buy it. Look at the sights right there. Right there. You have your traditional sights. The hammer does not come back. That's your safety. Right there. I mean, trigger release. Sorry, man, I'm freaking tired. 13 round magazine. It comes with these shitty 12 gram BBs. Like I said, I just bought this card board. It'll probably only last like a week. Safety. Right there. Oh, shit, sorry. Right there. You know, you could put it if you wanted to, but it'd probably just break the safety. But you know, carry it around the side, shoot some kids up, yeah. I'm immature, so don't say shit. That's what I do. I'm a gangster. No, I'm just kidding. But overall, the two piece gun, you can see the. Come up in the middle. See that line that runs off of these is with two pieces of plastic stuck together. It's only 190 FPS. <laughs> so, shoot myself. Won't hurt. I'll just say, ow. Um, the magazine's actually a really nice magazine. As you can see. And the real SIG, the real SIG Seller P228 is actually the gun, where I live, is actually the primary police pistol. Pretty cool. I don't see why they choose that. I see they should use a Glock. Glock 17, Glock 26, Glock 18, Glock 80. You know those ones? Yeah. But, first gun review. This is my fifth airsoft gun. Don't say shit. Oh, I shoot you. And I know my gun safety. I have a gun license. This ain't gonna harm anyone. Well, what if you got shot in the face? That would look like shit. I actually haven't been shot by yet. I've had it for about 20 minutes. I shot it four times, so I know. Still breaking the gun in. The magazine goes in real nice. Goes in real nice. Here, I'll let you listen. Can you hear that click? Come on, sick. Um. Sit. I don't know if you guys. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see me. So I'm gonna cock it for you. It actually has pretty hard for forcing that gun. For the quality. It's a freaking hard cock for the gun. Here, let's see. You hear that? Oh, I didn't need to cock it away. Fuck. When you cock it twice, the baby comes out. I oh, know, stupid. There we go. It's cocked all the way now. Okay. Like I said, I said there's a gun. Bought it because I was bored. Shot it. There you go. So as you guys can see, pretty shitty ass gun. It's the cheapest airsoft gun I've ever got. I mean, the first gun I got was Crossman P36. Then I got a Crossman P9. Then I got a Smith and Wesson M4505. Then I got this little shitty Uzi. And now I have this six hour P28.
if you ask me. Worst gun I've ever had. But good for the price. Freaking good for the price. You can't beat this for the price. Really can't. But there's the review. I know you guys didn't ask for this, but like I said, butterflies board, good for the round gun, you know, she frames down down, you know. It's a little backyard war right there, so you don't need anything big for backyard war. Really good sight on for those guys that like pistols. It's a freaking heavy gun though. It's probably about three pounds. But I think I think if you take the grip off, it'll have those weights like they do in the Smith Weapon and the Fest. But that is my review on the 6RP228. Hope y'all you guys enjoy. Bye.